what's going on guys welcome to my youtube channel dash divinity or dash your art whenever the content pertains to art music clothes and our hair if you haven't already go ahead and press that like and subscribe button and then press that notification bell to stay updated on when i post and in today's video guys we're gonna i'm gonna be coming at you all with a wash day routine and a product review from a black owned business from my hometown so the brand name of this black owned company is shay souffle and it is ran by Teresa wilson i'm gonna have her information within the description box below so that you guys can contact her if you guys do um wind up purchasing if you guys are interested in purchasing any of these products and so with this bundle, you're going to get your Shea Souffle, you're going to get a leave-in conditioner and natural oils for it, and then you're also going to get shampoo and conditioner. And this bundle costs $55 altogether. Starting off with any wash routine, I always like to moisten my hair first, obviously. <laughs> but then I always use a conditioner just to detangle my hair before I add anything to my head. So right here we have the Aussie Moist Conditioner. You know, this is not a promotion for them. But we're just going to be adding a generous amount of this to my hair just to start with the detangling process. And then I'm just going to try to apply it evenly like throughout the sections of my hair, which I will section off later on. <laughs> making sure that I get all the ends filled with all this conditioner then I'm just starting to detangle it with my fingers real quick just before I add any wild to a comb or a pick to it this way it'll just save me like uh from having so many knots already within it and then also just doing that it, al it already reduces the amount of shit hair that you have as well as the amount of breakage you'll experience <laughs> me to detangle your hair you're gonna really want to proceed with caution because that thing will prick the hell out of your hand will have that thing feeling like you just went straight through it Alright, so when it comes to doing my hair, like whenever I'm like washing it or conditioning it, I always like to just go ahead and part it. And well, not necessarily part it. I'm just trying to be super neat here for the video, I guess. But uh, I normally just put my hair into twists so that when I wash my hair, it's not gonna be that much shed hair all up in the shower, you know, clogging the drain. So I always just like to put my hair into twists. And then when you wash your hair like this, already twist it up, it saves you more time just for the fact that you don't have to detangle your hair constantly or you don't have to keep combing through your hair. And then it just saves your hair from experiencing any more breakage than it would have if it was free form or free or, you know, free flowing.
All right, so now that I'm done with all these twists, I'm gonna go ahead and rinse the uh, conditioner out and then come back and add the shampoo. All right, so with this shampoo, this shampoo, like it really takes a small amount of it just for it to travel, as long as your hair is already damp or moist. Um, I wanna say with all of these products, a little bit goes a long way with them, but with this shampoo, it's like super clarifying, has a strong smell to it, but one that's not very overbearing, but one that's so strong to the point that you know that your scalp is getting clean. It's like this shit just felt so good in my head, yo. Like I just, I just had to close my eyes while I was rubbing that shit in. <laughs> this is a good ass shampoo. So yeah, y'all need to fuck that shampoo. <laughs> That shit feels so good in my goddamn scalp. But man, you know when that air just hit your scalp and that shit just all the airflow coming through like Lord, Lord, this shit feels so good in my head. And if you got an undercut like me, you wanna make sure that you get those sides. Alright, now that we got all that rinsed out, we're going to start adding in this conditioner. So the conditioner pretty much smells pretty similar to the shampoo, but it's like a not so potent smell, if that makes sense. Like, it's the same smell almost to a certain extent, but it's dialed down. Like, it's meant to condition your hair, whereas the shampoo is strong to the extent that it needs to clarify, to purge, and to cleanse all the stuff off that's on your shaft or your scalp in and of itself. Um, but right here, I'm just comparing the two smells and pretty much saying the same thing I'm saying now. And don't even mind me uh, talking in this video because it's like I'm already talking to you guys within the video. But I had to speed the video up so none of the stuff that I said in the video is actually going to be applied to it because I'm doing a voiceover now. But it's kind of like just mental notes for me to include um, just so I can still remember exactly what the fuck I actually said, you feel me? Alright, so after we get all of that rinsed out, I'm going to be coming in with the hair products themselves. I'm going to be starting with the leave-in conditioner, but I'm just showing you guys the consistency of the Shea Souffle. Like I said, how it starts to do, like when it gets warm in your room, like it's really the consistency of like a whole little milk almost, like a thick-ass milk. And right here we have that leave-in conditioner. Like with these, all of these, a little bit goes a long way. Um, but I want to say for that leave-in conditioner, in the future, I would like to see a bigger bottle for that one though. But I guess I could like order a bigger size if I needed to. But I had really bought all of these in a bundle. Like this whole bundle was uh, $55 all together. But I would say like in the future using these products, now that I have like used these products multiple times already, I would uh, start with applying these products on dry hair because like with these products, they're not really style or products. They don't really perform in the sense that your hair needs to be wet you could literally apply these to your hair while it's dry um, because it'll have you thinking that you need to add more product to your hair because it's not like lathering a particular way or just just out of that same instance because like in this video you'll see me adding more product more product than I need and then 
at the end of the video um i pretty much didn't say it at the end of the video but it, it left my hair feeling like super oily just because of the fact that i added so much product and for the fact that i put my hair into twist and i'm trying to add it to each and individual strand you know what i'm saying so it's just like with this product a little bit goes a long way for each and every product that i have on here so it's like you don't really need to add that much Alright, so now that I'm done with applying all of the products, I'm gonna be blow drying my hair. Not in the video, but I already blow dried it, and then I'm just gonna be showing, taking it down and showing you guys what my hair looks like. Um, trust and believe that my hair is super moisturized just for the fact that I added way too much product. <laughs> but I'm just gonna be taking it down, showing you guys what it looks like. It is not completely dry, it's still gonna be kind of damp in this. Um, so the results will vary based on that. Simple fact. You feel me? You feel me? I just do a general unraveling of all the twists, go around my whole head, taking them all down, and then I'm gonna go back and then separate them more definitively. Uh, twist out results came out pretty good um i really wasn't expecting this product to do that much necessarily for the twist out because it's not really like a style of product like i said but it is a product that does great at hydrating and nourishing your hair because of the contents that's just within it um but if you haven't already guys go ahead and press that like and subscribe button and make sure you press the notification bell to stay updated on when i post thank you guys for watching this video please rate comment and subscribe peace and these were the results, by the way. <laughs> I was headed to a friend's baby shower, so this is what I was pretty much getting ready for within the video.